My name is Jerry. I'm a library program specialist at the Barbara Bush Library Branch. Today, I'm going to show you how to access two of our free databases that offer online citizenship test prep coursework. To begin, you'll want to go to the Harris County Public Library website. To do that, you'll just have to type over here in your search bar www.hcpl.net and click enter. Once you do that, you will be taken to the Harris County Public Library website. After that, go ahead and click on the tab that says Explore. Once you select the Explore option, you will be taken to the section on the catalog website. Here, go ahead and click on the tab that says Research and Learn. We are now in the database section of the website. To your left, you will see an option to filter the resources. To your right, it will show you all of our 120 databases. So let's go ahead and scroll down and select the option that says Languages. Once I select the option for Languages, I can see that now my results show two. This is the Learning Express Library and the Transparent Language Online Library resource. I will use both of these to access the free Citizenship Test Prep coursework. First, let's go ahead and take a look at Transparent Language. To access the resource, let's click over here in the blue box that says Go to Resource. Once I've selected that, then I am taken to the Transparent Language Online interface. We have three options up here. If you already have an account, we can click Login, put in our username and our password, and then click here to log in. If we're a new user, we'll want to click over here where it says Sign Up. We'll want to put in your library card number, that is that 240 number in the back of your library card, and then click Submit. Once we do that, then we are taken to the option to select our username, our password, and agree with the term services to create a account with Transparent Language. All right, since I have an account, I went out ahead and logged in with my account. Once I did that, then I was taken to this section of the Transparent Language um, database. It is in the section that allows you to choose a language to learn. Now, to find the citizenship test prep coursework, you'll first want to go over here where it says English. Go ahead and click on it. Once you do that, you're going to select the option that says English Immersion for Everyone and click on it. Once you do that, then you're taken to your learning path. I am right now in the learning path for the Learning English for Everyone. Over here, I'm going to go ahead and click where it says Browse. The Browse option offers me additional categories, so I'm going to go ahead and scroll down a little bit and select here where it says American Citizenship Course, and then click on the little arrow. As we can see, I have access to the American Citizenship Course. Here are the different categories, Constitution and Branches of the Government, Law and Civic Responsibilities, Colonial American History, 1800 American History, 1900 and Recent American History, and Geography, Symbols, and Holidays. So if I go, want to look and see what Constitution and Branches of the Government offer, I'm going to click on the arrow again. Now we can see that the category has been subdivided into seven lessons. To add these lessons to my learning path, I just have to go over here and click on the little plus sign. This will automatically add them to my learning path. If I go over here, or that's the little three dots, and I click down, I can see that it, I can add it again to my learning path if I don't want to use the plus sign. I can view vocabulary associated with this lesson. I can mark this lesson as learn, or I can get a shareable link.
Okay, so let's take a quick look at Constitution and Branches of Government, Lesson 1. Alright, so this is what the Lesson 1 for the Unit 1 looks like. As we can see, on the top left corner, I can see, click over here and see the menu. I can see that the lesson is subdivided into three sub-lessons. I can print and save my work. I can take a look over here and see the objectives, specifically the one for Unit 1 Lesson 1. To get rid of the objectives, I can just click over here in the middle. To start learning, I can just go over here and click Resume Learning. Top right corner, I can see references associated with the lessons. And over here, I can manage the audio. To go back to the lesson, I just have to click on the little back button at the very top left corner. Okay, let's click over here for resume learning. So similar to before, I can kick any, click anywhere over here to get rid of this. To move on to different parts of the lesson, I just click next. And over here, I can manage my volume and make it play slower if I wanted to. So let's click on the back. And I have returned over here to the category for Constitution and Branches of the Government. And click on Categories. Go back to the beginning. And just click over here to return. Okay. And that's a basic overview on how to find um, the Americans or U.S. Citizenship Test Prep Coursework in Transparent Language. Now let's go take a look at the U.S. Citizenship Test Prep Coursework offered in a donut database, Learning Express. Okay, so I went ahead and I click on the little X next to the tab that says Transparent Language. This returned me back to the Harris County Public Library website, the Research and Learn section of the website. So this time let's go ahead and click on Learning Express and go to Resource. Okay, I'm in the online remote section for Learning Express. So to access Learning Express from my home, I am going to once again meet my library card number, that 240 number in the back of my library card. I'm going to head and put this number right here and then click Enter. Alright, so once I, I went ahead and I put my library card number and I click enter, I was taken to the Learning Express Library Hub. To find the Citizenship Test Prep coursework, you are going to want to go ahead and click where it says Adult Course Skills. Similar to the transparent language, it breaks it down into categories. Let's select Become a U.S. Citizen. All right, we are now in the Adult Core Skills Center, specifically in the category to become a U.S. citizen. Okay, so as we can see, they have four main subcategories. Prepare for your citizenship exam. And then here are some lessons set to it. Get your green card. In Spanish, the same thing. Prepárese para su examen de ciudadanía, and then same as this one, but in Spanish, gana su tarjeta verde. Let's take a look at prepare for your citizenship exam. So as we can see, we have a section for test practice, ebooks, articles, and flashcards you can use to prep. Let's go ahead and select the option citizenship ebooks. All right, so the Learning Express offers us an ebook 
for the Pass the U.S. Citizenship Exam 5th Edition. To access this ebook, I'm going to click over here where it says Sign In or Register to Begin. If you're a new user, you'll want to click over here where it says Register. As we can see, it'll automatically default, default uh, our institution as the Harris County Public Library since you logged in with the 240 number and you'll just have to complete all the things fields that have the asterisk to create your um, account with them then click register. If you already have an account then you just go ahead and put your username and password. I'm gonna do that since I already have an account with Learning Express. Okay as we can see once I log in I can have access to my account and now I cannot go ahead and download the ebook as a PDF file. So if I wanted to explore or other areas of the citizenship test prep, I can just go over here and click over, click over here in the arrow. And then I can navigate this time. Let's take a look at citizenship test practice. All right. So as you can see, it says that this interactive tutorial consists of 100 civic questions found on the official naturalization test and is geared towards helping you achieve the best possible score. To access that, I'm just going to click over here where it says Start Tutorial. Okay, and this is what the test prep tutorial looks like. It starts you off with the introduction. It tells you to begin to take the pretest to assess your current skills and knowledge about um, the citizenship test. You can also start the tutorial from the beginning by clicking Start Tutorial, or you can click in any of the options of the left side menu. So the pretest, the test practice of questions, and the post test. So let's click over here for citizenship test practice of questions. And let's click on the little arrow. Similar to transparent language, um, the lessons are divided. Um, into categories. Um, last time it was unit for um, transparent language. Over here it's lessons. If I click on the little plus sign, I can see how American government is divided into sub lessons. Same thing for American history. And finally for integrated civics. Um, you will notice a lot of overlap with categories in transparent language, whereas transparent language was introducing you to um, information, knowledge, and skills about the categories. This section over here goes ahead and helps you, in Learning Express, helps you test your knowledge gain from the categories you were introduced to in transparent language. And that's a basic overview of how to access the sources for Transparent Language and for Learning Express for the online citizenship test prep coursework. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this tutorial. If you have any questions or comments about um, Learning Express or Transparent Language and the resources offered for citizenship test prep, um, go ahead and leave those comments in the comment section below. We would love to hear from you. Um, we hope you have an excellent week and you stay safe. Bye.